How's it going everybody? Welcome back to my workbench. Today I'm going to be testing my new DSS SSR4E. This is a mini companion board that I designed to be paired with Mesa Electronics Ethernet Anything I.O. boards. Today I have it wired into a Mesa Electronics 7i92T. I'm going to launch Linux CNC and open up HAL Show. I'll overlay that on your screen with my editing software so you can see what I'm doing. I'm going to be testing all four outputs and looking for status indicator LED illumination as well as counting the encoder count, both in the positive and negative direction, clockwise or counterclockwise, depending on the input of the encoder. Now this board provides me with four transformer isolated two amp SSR outputs that act as low side switches. Basically it's just a inline switch with the circuit, as well as a isolated encoder input that does need to have its encoder powered independently of the board. The board itself receives five volt and ground from the main MESA board that it's connected to. Again, in this case, the 7i92T. So let me go ahead and launch Linux CNC and open up HAL Show. And I'll start by setting the outputs for each of the SSRs. Excellent. And sure enough, we do have illumination on our status indicators. And if we rotate the encoder wheel, we get positive and negative counts, just as we would expect. Awesome. So this board is working as I intended it to now. There is probably no more revisions that I'm gonna be doing to this board. I'm happy at the current state. The prior board was simply four transformer isolated SSR outputs. There was no encoder input. This offers me all the functionality I need to get my Sphinx CNC machine up and running with a MESA 7i92T as well as a Gecko G540. If you guys have any questions, leave me a comment down below. If you guys have any suggestions, also leave me a comment down below. Hope you all have a great day.